OK, so we've had an introduction to the number line to visualise adding and subtracting numbers to get totals above and below zero. Click here to view the previous video if you missed it. Also, a link to a version of the software that I'm using to generate these graphics is in the video description below. So far we've seen negative numbers as a position or value. For example, minus two is two steps below zero. We can also use negative to refer to the direction of the step. Positive steps go up and negative steps go down. Minus two is the same size and direction whether it refers to where we are, called the value, or what we're doing, called the operation. Let's start with the familiar positive numbers by considering the equation two plus two plus three equals seven. Subtracting is the same as taking away, so we can subtract any step by deleting it from our path. Subtracting or deleting the plus three step brings us back to a total of four, a value change of minus three. Let's restore the plus three step and compare the effect of adding a minus three step. As you can see, this also takes us back to a total of 4. So we can see that subtracting a positive number is the same as adding a negative number of the same size. This means that we can express any combination of upward and downward steps as the sum of steps, rather than using a combination of addition and subtraction. Try this with a few different examples of your own to satisfy yourself that it works with a range of values. That takes care of adding negative steps, but what about subtracting them? Consider the equation 5 plus 2 minus 4 equals 3. If we subtract the final step of minus 4, we can see that the answer increases in value from 3 to 7, a change in value of plus 4. Let's confirm this by restoring the minus 4 step and then adding a plus 4 step to the end. As we can see, this also changes the value by plus 4, showing that subtracting a negative number is equivalent to adding a positive number of the same size. Again, try this with a few examples of your own to satisfy yourself that it works. So, in summary, adding a negative number is equivalent to subtracting a positive number of the same size, and subtracting a negative number is equivalent to adding a positive number of the same size.